Here I am at Arches National Park in Moab, Utah. This is just near the, no, just, I just went through the entrance, so I haven't seen any arches yet. But pretty impressive rock formations out here though. Ik heb er op. Ik er niet op. Nee, nee. There is a delicate arch. So now we might have sit down from the arch. This kind of reminds me of going up the stone mountain in a way. Minus all the humidity, of course. But the wind is pretty warm and the sun is beating down. So, delicate arch is in the books now. <laughs> Been there, done that, got the t-shirt. So now it's on to the rest of the park. The thing is, when I first went up this, I thought that when I made it to the top that 
delicate arch would be at the top, and I could see it. It actually was about just half the way there, <laughs> but it did level out. Um, so this is called the fiery furnace. This is a sand dune arch. Green sand dunes? Look at this. So there is Broken Arch in all her glory. It's an echo. <laughs> uh. Boy, living creature I saw moving on the way out here near the trail was a lizard, and that was it. The mountains back there. I found that when you're out here hiking and everything, you know, there's not any shade at all until you get to the biggest rock you can find that has a, how it overhangs above you like that, ledge kinda. And then you just kinda lean up in the shade here and take a break. And after you dry out or you catch your breath and everything, then you, you go to the next place. It's real scenic though, as you can see. Real peaceful too. I mean, there's there's some places where there's tourists everywhere, and then you go to a place, random place like this at the park, and then there's there's not anybody. This is called the Devil's Garden. I'm hoping to pass through the Devil's Garden before I see the landscape arch and a few other arches. There is landscape arch.
crow. Yeah. There is double O arch. Uh, should I, oh, it, uh, it adjusts uh, automatically, I guess. Wow, that's nice, I think. This is called the Black Arch Overlook. the uh, primitive trail they call it. You uh, have to climb up uh, rocks, boulders, <laughs> and then look for these small stacks of rocks. Now when I first got here I thought, oh you know, some kid came up here, you know, maybe sat around, got bored, and started building a rock pile. Well, I soon discovered that the purpose of the rock piles is to let you know where the trail is located. Um, but even as I'm walking here, I mean, here is here is an arrow pointing directly in that direction, saying, "Hey, there's the trail." And it's part of the trail too, though. So it gets interesting, and sometimes you got to think about how you're going to go about getting up the rock and getting to the trail where you need to be. But you get these amazing views. This is called Partition Arch.